Welcome to Storytelling for Kids, where imagination takes flight. Dive into a world where fairy tales come to life, where dragons roam, and where every bedtime story sparks a magical adventure. Don't miss out on our weekly dose of excitement. Hit that subscribe button and join our ever-growing family of story enthusiasts. By subscribing, you're not just opening the door to more thrilling adventures, you're becoming a part of a community that cherishes the magic of storytelling. So, gather around, little ones, and grown-ups alike, as we embark on a never-ending quest to explore the limitless wonders of imagination. Subscribe now and be prepared to be swept away into a world where dreams take flight and stories come to life. Once upon a time in a bustling kingdom far, far away, there lived a young girl named Ella. Ella wasn't your typical princess. She didn't live in a grand castle or wear fancy dresses. Instead, she lived in a small cottage on the outskirts of the kingdom with her kind-hearted stepmother and two stepsisters, Lily and Rose. Despite her humble surroundings, Ella had a heart as pure as gold and a spirit that could light up even the gloomiest of days. One bright and sunny morning, as Ella was tending to her chores in the garden, she heard a rustling in the bushes. Curious, she went over to investigate and found a young girl with ebony hair and rosy cheeks, dressed in a vibrant blue gown. It was none other than Snow White, the princess of a nearby kingdom. "'Hello there! Are you lost?' Ella asked with a warm smile. Snow White smiled back, her eyes sparkling with kindness. "'Oh no, I'm not lost. I was just exploring the forest and happened to wander this way. What's your name?' I'm Ella, she replied. It's lovely to meet you, Snow White. The two girls chatted and laughed, discovering that they had much in common despite their different backgrounds. Snow White told Ella about her adventures with the seven dwarfs, and Ella shared stories of her life in the cottage with her stepmother and stepsisters. As they talked, a mischievous band of forest creatures, led by a playful squirrel named Nutty, joined in the conversation. Nutty, being the adventurous sort, suggested they go on a quest together to find a magical treasure— rumored to be hidden deep within the enchanted woods. Excited by the idea of an adventure, Ella and Snow White agreed and the group set off on their quest, their laughter filling the air. Along the way, they encountered talking trees, mischievous fairies, and even a friendly dragon named Spark who helped them navigate through the Densey Forest. During their journey, they faced many challenges, but with their newfound friendship and teamwork, they overcame every obstacle in their path. They outsmarted cunning witches, solved riddles, and braved treacherous terrains, all while supporting and encouraging one another. As they neared the location of the magical treasure, they stumbled upon an ancient castle, hidden behind thick vines and guarded by a fierce giant. Determined to claim the treasure, Ella, Snow White, and their animal friends devised a clever plan to distract the giant while they sneaked inside. Inside the castle, they discovered the treasure room— filled with sparkling jewels, enchanted artifacts, and mysterious potions. But what caught their eyes the most was a magical mirror that could reveal the truest desires of one's heart. Curiosity peaked. Ella and Snow White gazed into the mirror together. To their surprise, the mirror showed them visions of a kingdom where kindness reigned, where everyone helped one another, and where love and friendship knew no bounds. Inspired by the vision, Ella and Snow White made a pact to bring such a kingdom to life in their own lands— with the magical mirror in hand, they returned to their respective kingdoms, where they shared their incredible adventure and the lessons they had learned about friendship, bravery, and the power of working together. The people of both kingdoms were inspired by their tale and embraced the values of kindness and compassion. And so, the story of young Cinderella and Snow White became a beloved legend, a reminder to all that no adventure is too grand, no challenge too daunting when faced with true friendship and a heart full of courage. And in the hearts of children— the tale lived on, inspiring generations to come with its message of love, unity, and the magic that lies within us all. And that, my dear friends, is the end of this extraordinary tale. Remember, no matter where life takes you, always cherish the friends you make along the way, for they are the true treasures that make every adventure worthwhile. The End Thank you for joining us on this magical journey at Storytelling for Kids. We hope you enjoyed the enchanting stories and delightful adventures that we shared today. 
If you found joy, laughter, or a valuable lesson in our tales, please consider giving us a thumbs up and sharing your favorite stories with your friends and family. Your support means the world to us and helps us continue spreading the magic of storytelling to children and families around the globe. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to stay updated with our latest uploads, ensuring you never miss out on the excitement. And of course, if you haven't tea already, be sure to subscribe to Storytelling for Kids. See you in the next magical tale.